Hello. We are the Film Picks. We're here to do a show. We're on Geek Nation. We are the Film Picks. I am your host. My name is Stephen Falk. To my left is Stephen J. Skelton. He is a fine young man. That's true. And then there's Todd Robert Anderson. He <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm getting uh, so sorry. tired. I don't know what that was, uh, what I was doing. But then I realized I may be violating uh, a lot of like uh, ASCAP rules by singing another melody. Maybe. I don't know. I may have made that up. Todd Robert Anderson. Hey. And, uh, and this is our guest. Alex Black. Alex Black. Alex Black. Uh, he did it. We started already. <laughs> oh, yeah. the show. Is Remember great. when I was singing? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, you thought that was my my warm up. I, I thought you yeah. were having a no, seizure. That's, just, uh, <laughs> that's Alex Black. He created uh, the, a hit, singing the, the, the the hit show on Comedy Central called At Midnight. Oh. It's uh, it's 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 on its third fourth season. Yeah, we ruined Twitter. So that's the cool Twitter. thing about us. Yeah. Anyway, very funny, very funny to see all your favorite comedians uh, hosting for points. Or, or, or and a lot of film picks guests turn up on that show. Yeah. Janet Varney. Mm. Yeah. Doug Benson. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, that's all I have. And others. We're a gateway. Steve Agee. Steve, Steve Agee, yeah. of course. Agee. We're, a we're a gateway show. We're a, we're a gateway, gateway show. show. <laughs> anyway, uh, welcome to Film Pigs. I'm sorry I sang at you. Uh, I, that just happened. But what I've learned in improv, you just have to just go with it. You yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. And yes, and yes, and yes, and and yes, and no, yourself. No, no, no. But the thing about improv <laughs> is that you need to. Sorry, Alex Black. Alex Black. <laughs> anyway, guys, um, we're gonna start the way we uh, always do with a little bit of popcorn. We gave Ooh. him some uh, some clear popcorn, mm -hmm. uh, and he lost it. So. Anyway, uh, just here. popcorn, <laughs> popcorn, popcorn. He was using it popcorn. as a prop in the sketch. He probably mm -hmm. didn't realize mm -hmm. he was supposed to pull Delicious. It. Listen, you guys, uh, time has come to get real. The year is like, is you're like three song? good months uh -huh. into the year now. Uh, things are real. Now, you can't coast anymore no. on your failed uh, resolutions, no. on, on, the, on the hurt of last year. No. 2015 is over. It's now 16, you got to get serious. It's you in full got, effect. It's you, in full effect. You have yeah. to find love. How do you find love? You I go on dates. Oh. What do you do on dates? Yeah, you can go to dinner, but that that requires a lot of talk. You have to and, talk to people. And there's something Man, so... Bummer. The studies show 84% of adults are very scared of conversation. Because conversation, there's a lot of it. pressure. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, but what can everyone do? You... you you can go to the movies. You can sit next to oh. your honey. Let your other people do the talking honey. for you. Yeah. Let the yes. writers of Hollywood. No words. Do the talkings for you. And then you get out mm. and you have something to talk about. Mm -hmm. And you take her out for a nice nightcap or him or them or, or whoever. And how are you going to know what to see? This is a long way of saying, come to us. We'll tell you what yeah. movies yeah. to see that are opening this Friday, what to avoid in order to maximize your sh your snuggle times. Snuggles. Now, um, uh, and, you know, and you can take it any way you want. You can take a movie that we hate, go to that because you operate best. Your wheelhouse is cynicism, like most of us. Right, right, or right. Or if or you're, like it, when the when your date gets bored, that's snuggles. when they're more likely to snuggle because they're bored. I'm snuggles, bored. I'll right. snuggle. I'll you, make it more interesting. You get some snuggles. You get some palmings. Palmings. Oh, I love. Some, I love. I love like dark get, movie like, theater palmings. Like some, <laughs> yeah. like like ru, like better. making a making a fire. Yeah, you get it. Like, Any rub, of those you rub your hands so, together. So this is this segment where about. we tell you <laughs> it's called rash judgment, where we the film pigs <laughs> tell you what movies you should see this Friday. Or I mean, it's opening this Friday based on based on nothing but our dickish instincts. And uh, this is Steve Skelton. Hey, you guys, I got the movie for you if you like movie snuggles and palmings. It's called Everybody Wants Some. Did you remember to powder before the... You don't powder before movie palmings. Okay. Everybody knows that. Time. Talking about it gets powder. too dry. So it's called Everybody Wants Some. It's the lady. It's the latest <laughs> Richard Linklater movie who brought you Days and Confused. That's already coming out? Yeah, mm. it's coming oh, out. So Everybody excited. wants Every, some. And it's like a bunch of guys I at college. Shut up. I'm a dancing, I'm a dancing shut hamburger. Up. Shut up. It's a bunch of guys in the 80s in college doing 80s college guys stuff. 
And uh, what is that? Define that. I'm not really sure because honestly, listening to Palming, Devo. I lo- I, <laughs> Palming. <laughs> Palming, yeah. Because uh, the 80, early 80s, that's when Palming, Palming, Palming really Tronning. took off. You got a Tron. You got a lot a of Tron. Tron. Yeah. Yeah. Tron. In fact, a lot Tron. of people, a lot of college kids in in like the early 80s lied about how much Troning they did because uh, they wanted. Oh, to you gotta do in. some Intellivisioning. <laughs> I only ever Troned with a girl from uh, Canada. <laughs> Name yeah, was, yeah you probably don't know her. Yeah. Her name was yeah. Natasha. What's this movie like? <laughs> it's like, uh, it looks like the 80s. Here's the thing is, um, I love Dazed and Confused. The trailer for Everybody Wants Some doesn't look that great, but it does look like it has this nice 80s film stock look to it. It got a rapturous, and, uh, uh, um, what do you call it, reception yeah. at yeah, South, South by. By. So it's Linkletter but, doing an 80s Dazed and yeah. Confused. That's so, what I love about those Linkletter movies, man. I get older, they kind of go back to the next <laughs> decade and sort of the same, same thing. Yeah, there you go. Uh, <laughs> did you bring any weed? Uh, no, I've just been... Uh, <laughs> Been standing next to the old. Uh, cooler if you did. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, you know, I didn't like the trailer, but I still want to see the movie. All right, uh, Steve Skelton, everybody wants a mixed review. Todd, hey, uh, hey, do you want to take your girl or guy to a horror film so they get scared and they uh, snuggle? Cut, they snuggle. They with snuggle you. and palm they you. They snuggle. They scared snuggle and palm you to get comfort. Well, here's the good news. Uh, there's a it's movie insane. called Amityville: The Awakening, what? Uh-uh. starring Jennifer Jason Leigh, Uh-oh. opening this weekend, April first. April Fools! They've delayed the release date of this movie to January 2017, <laughs> making it the latest Amityville franchise sequel that's probably never going to see the light of day. <laughs> Meaning that the last one was called Amityville The Lost Tapes and it was an Amityville found footage movie that I think we rash judged on this show seven times. <laughs> and it was never released to the public, not even on video. And this one's on a fast track to be the so same you're, thing. So you're going to have to found but, footage that found footage. Yeah, you got to found footage these found footage movies. Uh, you can't watch this movie because they just announced literally in the last two days that they're not releasing it on the date that they said The they point were. is don't murder your family. Don't <laughs> kill your family. <laughs> just because the house is like, kill your family. You don't have to. Don't listen to the house. Don't All right, guys. House. That's yeah. rash judgments. Yeah. Now, <laughs> wait. Wait. Doesn't, Doesn't Alex? I think you were a little rash <laughs> on your judgment <laughs> of when this bit's ending. Because I got a sweet movie. Now, we are just four white guys. But what yeah. do all white guys have? One black friend. <laughs> oh. Yes. And uh, the movie this week that I want to talk about is called Meet the Blacks. A you great movie. Tell that, tell tell that, that camera, camera, if you want to snuggle with your one black friend and have a really, <laughs> really, Really awkward <laughs> post palming conversation. Mm. This is the movie for you. I have no idea what it's about, but I think it's some kind of like Wayans Brothers parody take on The Purge. But there's a, a black family that moves to Beverly Hills, but then for some reason, everybody is trying to kill all the black people. And Mike Tyson's there, and Charlie I Murphy. I don't think that's science and fiction. That's I just, think it was written. That's just Beverly Hills. That's just Trump 2016. Yeah, yeah. It was, it's basically a, a, a futuristic look at the Trump presidency <laughs> in the guise of a Wayans brother fun <laughs> romp where black people are hunted in the streets of America. Oh uh, so that should be a good one to go watch, a real popcorn flick. <laughs> Uh, for snuggles and, <laughs> you know, racial sensitivity discussions. Wow. Well, thank Holy you. Shit, nice. Thank you, Alex Blake. Sorry I jumped. Is that jumped really it. what that movie is? I think so. I, I just, <laughs> oh that was God. my rash judgment. I, I, I can't I wait to see say, the trailer. Yeah. Watch the trailer for yourselves. Very confusing. Hit me up on Twitter if you have a better interpretation <laughs> of what that movie is about or trying to say. I would Literally, honestly, love to hear it. <laughs> All right, so right to uh, at Alex Blagg. Uh, thank you. Um, and I'm sorry I, I jumped the gun, but I'm just so excited about this next segment, which is, mm. you know, we at uh, the film things do nothing but care. Like it's literally, all we do. Like, you guys like, are like care bears. Yeah. Like yeah. we're, we're like care. care bears, but like like not furry and not cute. But we do shoot yeah. rainbows out of our tummies. Well, That's that, why they do. call us the film pigs. Yeah, but because our back, we care. Our back, our back tummies. 
Yeah. yeah. Anyway, we have, we have Rainbow Diary. Yeah. Uh, so anyway, uh, there's a there's a, a superhero movie uh, coming out this uh, summer. There's or spring, spring, spring. Yeah. Spring. Mm-hmm. And, very soon. Uh, very soon. You need to know. You need to know things about it. Yeah. Uh-huh. Would you say? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Fair to say. You, you can't know. walk into shit. No. Blank. You, you gotta blank. know what's no. up. Gotta... So uh, the, this is a little PSA. Uh, the film pigs have done about uh, Captain America. Cap. Colon. The Cap. Colon. colon Civil Soul. War. It's the Cap side. What should we do, guys? Oh. oh. Yeah. Where's the? Uh, gotta get the. Here. Here's I'll the guys. It. Guys. I'll spitball it. Guys. I'll spitball oh, it. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> If you like comic books, you're probably pretty excited about next week. A new Marvel movie is opening. Captain America Civil War, where Captain America and Iron Man fight each other instead of a bad guy. I think. So you gotta decide, are you Team Cap or are you Team Iron Man? Do you side with Captain America, who's for freedom? I guess and stuff. Or do you stand with Iron Man, who wants l- less freedom? Oh, and there's more uh, guys. Like, a lot more guys on both sides. I can't keep it straight. Vision, Black Widow, that douche Hawkeye. Falcon, Ant-Man, Black Panther. He's new. Is Hulk in this one? I don't think Hulk's in this one. Neither is Thor, I think. Wait, there's also, what's her name, uh, Scarlet Witch. I'm getting a headache. William Hurt. Are we sure Hulk's not in this one? Oh shit, Spider-Man's in this one too. What team's he on? Seriously, I don't feel good. This is more superheroes than in an Avengers movie. That's obnoxious. Winter Soldier! So this is basically Avengers versus Avengers, but it's not an Avengers movie. It's like a shooting pain behind my eyeballs. I like fun things, but this feels like I'm supposed to pay way too much attention to it. I'm tired of waiting for post credit scenes. Oh my God, it's almost two and a half hours long? That's too long. It's too long! It's just throbbing. No, it's just... Deadpool was under two hours. Under two hours is a good target running time for comic book movies. I don't know, I guess I'm on Team Cap. Team Iron Man, doesn't matter. Team Advil. Team Deadpool. Nick Fury's probably in this. You know we still have like two Avengers movies to go? This isn't gonna end anytime soon. We need to pace ourselves. Oh my God. Wow. wow. That was wow. helpful. Now I know everything I need to know. Yeah. Yeah. Like before you were you were blind, but now you can see. Yeah, I had no mm-hmm. clue. <laughs> I once after I threw up, I felt better. Yeah. Well, mm-hmm. listen, guys. Um It's amazing th- how that works. This like, week. You don't want to throw up because yeah. it's gross, but yeah. then when it happens, it, you feel better. Much like the film pigs. We're nearly over. <laughs> <laughs> so you now feel you better. feel better. Yeah. yeah. Look, uh, <laughs> there's a lot of things you can do on the internet. God, there's, there's, there's so much. There's, there's games, there's yeah. puzzles, Prano. there's yeah. pranks, uh, there's, there's sketches, there's foods. I'm partial to pranks. There's drudge like report. Pranks. There's drudges, there's long reads. You could yeah. go into the dark internet <laughs> and get reads. heroin and sex slaves. There's, there's yeah. tour, yeah. there's sex slaves, there's dark webs, there's Hungarian girls who will fulfill your every wish. But you've chosen. I got to get on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> I did great. not know about the Hungarian <laughs> oh, yeah. ladies. Uh, but, How happy? Know, well, they're really happy. They're yeah. happy. And it's just infectious. I don't think, that, I don't, <laughs> I don't think they're happy. But you chose us, <laughs> the Film Pigs. Please come back next week uh, where our guests again, because we're so lucky and so... Hashtag blessed will be Alex Blagg. Oh, Alex that's Blagg. Me. That's me. We get Thank you very TV. much. Oh, wow. On behalf of Todd Robert Anderson, Stephen J. Skelton. That's me. I'm uh, your Hungarian sex slave, Stephen Falk. Yeesh. And until next week. We get Alex Black again. Your concession stand has been closed. Oh
due to health code violations Alex and Black human trafficking. Again. Alex Black everybody. is back again. Alex Black is back again. Come back again. Come back again for Alex Black. We'll be I back again. I think they're done. I'm feeling really tired. <laughs>